Suzanne, I really need your help. I really don't have any style. My typical outfit is a black t-shirt with a cardigan and black pants every day. As for my hair, I usually put it in a ponytail or what I like to call a mom bun. I color it every month or so with whatever's on sale at the drugstore just to cover up the roots. I hardly wear any makeup at all except for a little bit of foundation and some lip gloss. I'm a busy single mother of three. I'm just completely stuck in a rut and I hope you can help me. So yeah, she's busy. We hear this time and again, she's busy. She puts herself kind of at the bottom of the list. She yeah. picks up her color at the drugstore, whatever's on sale. Yeah. Um, one of her friends, Trish, is with us in the audience today. And you're wearing a very bright, uh, colorful, very lovely shirt. Yes, thank you. Um, do you feel like she, your friend's been kind of a, kind of a, a bit of a rut for a while? Yes, definitely. I think she just focuses on everyone else. And on the kids. I've, she's a single mom, yeah. right? Yeah. So, she's got a lot on her plate. Yeah. But yes, yeah, she has a lot on her plate, and I think that's a common yeah, complaint among is. women. Absolutely. You know. And I have to back Trisha up because you guys, I'm going to show you. Trish, uh, Suzanne actually sent us samples of her week wardrobe. Oh, yeah, five different so pictures. You guys have that. to see these. Literally, that's a uniform. That's, a that's the proof. Uniform, yeah. Oh, look, she really went crazy on hump day. <laughs> I know. <laughs> right. She went crazy oh, on Wednesday. Oh, that's right. Brought out hump the, day. <laughs> the beige, yeah. OK, so uh, should we bring her on out? Yeah, yeah let's, let's bring her out. Come on out. adorable little figure oh, on you. Amazing. Thank you. You should walk around naked. Look at <laughs> you. <laughs> you look cute. Thank you. I mean, Suzanne, you know you look cute, right? Thank you. Right? I, I do now. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, talk talk through the look here. Thank you. So as far as her hair goes, so she has um, an oblong, sort of square oblong face. So the, the hair The hair's gorgeous. The hair that's mm -hmm. best for that is a long layered cut, which she had. So we took her to Cutler's. Uh, we love Cutler Salon Cutler here Salon. in New York. Our yeah. buddies there helped us out. We just tweaked her haircut a little bit. But we used the sort of the rule of threes in terms of her hair color. We, we went with her, we found her base, and we made her base a little bit better. But then we just went up about three shades for the highlighting. And it gives her highlighting that's natural, it's warm, it works with her skin tone, it's going to be easy for her to maintain, and it just sort of is spot on for her. It's not too much, but it's enough to, to really change her look. And very natural, very little makeup, what yeah. you're comfortable with, right? You, yeah. you're, you, 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 yeah. you like a little bit of lipstick, tiny yeah. bit of coverage. Yeah. So cute, though, with the little moto jacket and the comfy shirt and the whole thing. And it looks good. Isn't she cool? I mean, she's so cool. She was hiding under all those yeah. layers. And there's a reason Obviously, for that. Yeah. Yeah. So the first thing we started with is back to the foundation. And here it started with the bra that was kind of, it was the wrong size. I'll get into that. But it was also making her feel, she said, I just feel more comfortable with loose tops. Because when you're not feeling secure, well, and you don't, still you know, your loose, shape, but it's uncomfortable or insecure. Right. It is soft, but it's fitted. It's not right. like yeah. big sweatshirts right. are covering you. So you couldn't see her petite frame. Right. So the bottom line with the bra is that she was wearing a plunge bra that was cutting her off and the band size was 36 G the cup size was double d she is in a 34 hmm. g so even though the cup sounds bigger every time you go down in the back size she's very lucky and i'm very jealous and i'm <laughs> i'd be thrilled oh to God, have a cd anything <laughs> anything over the first two <laughs> why, yeah we want more what can we say so but the bottom line is is that just because you go up in a cup and i think we had this exchange you actually is that look very she cheap. looks it actually look makes much her look smaller now. exactly oh, because it's pulling it into her body so that's one thing the tip on the tops which we talked about is she can wear a fitted top great to have angles in your tops if you are someone who's well endowed or you have great shape but you want to make sure that you wear v-necks this has that v illusion with a little bit of open and see that angle at the bottom Cut it on an angle. that oh, helps beautiful. her and you look so petite in this honestly yeah, tiny it's just oh. i mean it really makes her look smaller and i think women are worried they're gonna look big, yeah. bigger yeah. Yeah. It's like but she big didn't look it very in all that fabric yeah. because it goes you were up. great your friend looks up Right? I think she looks amazing. She's a single I, mom. Take her out is. on the tip. Yeah. She's ready to go. Thank you. Thank you. Great Thank job. You.